I'm gonna show you another keyword strategy that you may like because this one is another option that you can do using Claude in order for you to enhance the keyword research and create more meaningful topics to your blogs or even to your YouTube channel if you have. So I'm gonna use Claude at the same time, we will be using Rapid APIC here because there is this free keyword tool that you can use and can give you good data right here with competition level and in the cost per click if you want to run ads, things like that. So as you know, when you are running that to Rapid AI, we may need to read this JSON in a granular way or a little bit technical because it's not that human readable, especially when someone is first time seeing JSON. So the best thing that you can do here is a great technique that you can use in Claude because Claude is very powerful now when creating apps, especially when using Claude 3.7. So what you can do right here, this is the example response from Rapid API. And then you will see this code snippet right here. Just copy everything. Now, going back to Claude, I'm going to tell so we will ask Claude to create a JavaScript application that we can run right away based off this API call right here. So we're going to see that. And before you do that, you need to add a sample response. So we will say the sample response is this is display them neatly. All right. So we're going to copy the sample response now. So go to results tab and copy everything and paste a sample response right there. So let's see if Claude will be able to create us a beautiful application that we can use now. And guys, just like that, Claude provided us this beautiful interface that we can use right away to fetch keywords and display them nicely. So we can have the sample data. So let's click the sample data. Look at this, guys. Look at how Claude displays. It's really nice. We have the volume and competition index, bid range, and the trend right here. Now we're going to have to enter actual data from the website. So this Google Keyword Insights, it will allow you to analyze keywords from a given URL. So let's say here on Google, I search this term cat training and let's find some website right here. Let's go to this one, cat training. I am going to copy the URL of this website and then analyze it using this L analyzer using Google Keyword Insights. And we're going to have to paste our rapid AP. So I'm just going to grab that from here. So don't worry guys, because I'm going to delete this anyway, this API key. I'm just going to show you how you can easily interact this rapid API in the application or the sample food snippets in Claude, then it will provide you a wonderful interface just like this. So let's fetch the keywords from this website right here. Let's fetch keywords. Something is wrong. So I think we're going to have to remove this. So instead of React, because Claude interface cannot run React application directly, so we ask Claude to modify it just using jQuery so we can easily run the application. So it created this jQuery right here, which we can use right now. So let's see if this will be able to call the actual result of our API and see the actual response. So first, we're going to, again, copy the URL of this website and then choose English and then the rapid API key. So we copy this and head up to our application, paste that. Guys, look at this. In the end, we still need to configure it in our local environment, which is very easy because this is jQuery. So you just need to open a Visual Studio code and then create index.html. Make, sh make sure to run this in a uh, HTTPS request, not just by opening index.html. And you see right here, we're able to capture keywords from this website right here just by applying the code that's given to us by Vyglod. Look at this very beautiful layout right here. The display of the data, it's very useful for us to, you, we can also ask Claude to have a functionality with the button right here that we can export it to CSV or to JSON or any type of format and we can distribute them. So look at how nicely this data being displayed. So you can also configure other functionality here in Google Keyword Insights, such as word research, just by adding this base keyword and it will show you the results. So the one that we added is this global resource results via URL. So we need to put the URL of the website and it will extract the keyword data, which will be displayed in this very nice readable format right here. So we can also try another website. Let's say for example, another website from cat training. So this one right here, which is the pumpkin.care. So let's copy the URL and paste it right here in our keyword tool. Fetch keywords so you can see it's loading. And there you go, guys. Look at this. Again, another 
and meaningful data that we can use as our reference to create topics so we are able to extract and analyze keywords from this website right here so look at this very nice data look at that very useful that we can distribute to our um, VA virtual assistant and ask them to create articles out of these keywords so that you will be able to analyze the uh, keyword if there's any gap from your competitor website right here so you can do that really it's very helpful just use cloud 3.7 and you'll be able to create any type of tools from rapid api just like that especially this very helpful keyword google keyword insight that's about it guys so i hope you learned something from this one so you can grab the url of this uh, keyword inside in the description below so you can access it directly and then just create an account here in rapid api and then integrate the same application as i showed you so ask them to create in jquery at in react because in react you need to set up a complex environment no js to run that but when using jquery you can directly run that without any issue so that's about it guys so i hope you'll get some insight about on this one and see you on the next one